remarkably cold day today. Quite refreshing. I just locked myself out. I probably need a warm cup of tea to defrost myself. Yeah, that's probably a good idea. Great. After you. Uh, my name is uh, Jim. I just moved next door. Jim? Yeah, it's um, short for Zibedine. Of course it is. I'm Sarah, by the way. It's a pleasure to meet you, Sarah. So what do you do when you're not having tea in other people's kitchens? Do you have a job? It's not just a job. It's my life. My purpose. My passion. Ta-da! It all started when I was just three years old. I was an aspiring little percussionist with small hands but big dreams. Now I play on the streets as often as I possibly can. I just want to spread happiness. That sounds interesting. Do you think so? Definitely. How do you manage to lock yourself out? Do you just lose your keys? Well, yeah. I probably lost it, burying the body. It's a joke. <laughs> so when do you think this locksmith will come? Well, last year I almost got killed outside flames. Yeah. Yeah. Is that the See the tambourine, you don't play it with your hand or your head. You have to play it with your heart. Okay, okay, I got it, I got it. The tambourine is always there for you, even when no one else is. Actually, wait here. I used to play this when I was a kid. No way! Did you know that in Sweden, in 1979, uh, homosexuality was still considered as an illness? So people, in order to protest, they used to call to work and sick and saying that they felt gay. Krakow and Poland. Oh, and this is Vienna. This is Helsinki. Not much to see here. Oh, this is the Alps. These are the rules. Well, I don't know what game you have with this little head of yours, but... Is that my dog? No, it's probably the locksmith over at my place. As if I won't have already frozen to death several times over by now. Well, I um, guess I'll see you around then. Or, uh, actually, what would you say about a cup of tea? Thank you.